we've got all the right ingredients for the semiconductor industry to grow, not only here in Markham, but, but help uh, support the industry here in Canada. There's excitement in Markham about the prospect of growing a new industry in town. Last week, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau said he would push to ensure Canada plays a significant role in the global semiconductor industry. Much of the world's semiconductors are made in Asia. During the peak of the pandemic, plants in China and Taiwan shut down, contributing to a global shortage in this essential component of electronic devices. You couldn't make a call without a semiconductor. You couldn't send a text without a semiconductor. Uh, your car, you couldn't be driving around without semiconductors. Um, they drive everything and life-saving technologies like uh, ventilators. Markham is looking to become the country's semiconductor hub. Leading the charge is the company Venture Lab, which has formed the Semiconductor Council. The council wants to make Canada a globally recognized developer, manufacturer, and supplier of semiconductor products. Canada has a great opportunity now to be a leader both from a development of these technologies as well on a long-term basis as a North American supply chain, you know, akin to the auto supply chain that we have in North America, so that, you know, some of these disruptions we've seen in the last couple of years from a supply point of view will be prevented in the future. The federal and provincial governments, along with Markham, are investing millions of dollars into Venture Lab's Hardware Catalyst Initiative, which is Canada's only lab and incubator for hardware and semiconductor companies. We've now provided for a lab and a space, the only one in the country, by the way, where you have both a research lab and a hardware lab where companies can actually test their technologies. They don't have to go elsewhere in the world. We can build on this strong foundation as, as we're expected as a, as a country and in North America to produce more semiconductors. We're well positioned. During the North American Leaders Summit last week, Canada, the U.S. and Mexico committed to holding their first ever trilateral semiconductor forum sometime in 2023 to increase sector investment across the continent. In Markham, I'm Brandon Rowe for City News.